Yo guys, it's Thomas and I'm back with a new tutorial for you guys. So, in this second uh, part of the tutorial, how to make a REST API in PHP, we're gonna look at the POST function and, well, let's start. So open up your editor and uh, open up our uh, REST.php file. Before we dive into coding, we're gonna install a Chrome app called Advanced REST Client. This allows us to make uh, REST requests to our server. So install it and it will open your uh, app. So yeah, go back to your uh, text editor and we're gonna uh, start with coding now. So. The first thing we need to do is we need to check if our um, post variables are set. So, if oh, if our uh, post file name the file name and our uh, post content are set then we need to uh, then we can do our uh, application print structure our post function but if it isn't set, if they aren't set then we uh, just uh, give an error just like uh, the error uh, out of the get method. So now we're gonna start the uh, post function for real. So uh, the second thing we need to do is we um, need to file put contents uh, as post. Yes, we need to do the post and then the file name in the first uh, parameter. The second parameter, we need to do our post content just like this. Easy, right? So, put a semicolon at the end and head over to your crow. So we need to get our uh, uh, URL for uh, from our REST API, and we need to paste it into the URL, and then we need to set our file name is test.txt, and our content is um hi i am i at test file just like this oops and then we can send it i think set response does not contain any data so this is right, and when we head back over to our uh, Sublime Text, here we have our test.txt with the content of Hi, I'm a test file. So this was the tutorial on uh, the post method. Um, just see my um, uh, video before this. Uh, about the get method if you didn't see that and I'll catch you next time. Bye.